Uh, lots of people are complaining about I'm not putting out enough videos and they're not good enough quality. Well, it's not my fault. Part of it's YouTube's fault and part of it's the fact that it's the summertime and everybody's, everybody's bothering me to do jobs for them. Whenever I'm home, the phone's ringing constantly. People always come into the door and those little bit of spaces in between, I try to do my six hours a day of running YouTube and doing personal messages. You know, six hours a day, seven days a week adds up to over 40 hours a week. So that's a full-time job. I still have a house to run, cats to look after, a farm to maintain. The weather sucks this summer. It's been raining all the time. So some days I can't make a video all week because every day it rains. It's so dark out and I can't film them in my basement because that's where I live and it's dark there too. And then when it's done raining, I've got to spend five and a half hours every week cutting the grass at the farm. And then with all the traffic and all the people showing up on weekends with all the cars and uh, stuff we're doing on the farm and driving around, my laneways are getting destroyed in giant potholes all the time. During all this, as you know, my bulldozer clutch broke. So that took an afternoon to take apart. And then on another day when I found when it wasn't raining, it took an afternoon to put back together. Then all the traveling to the other side of my city to drop the part off, get the part back. Then the backhoe broke, a hydraulic line blew. Just as I was lifting my seat mechanism to put on that fast Astro van to make it into a redneck van. So two days later I get that fixed and then today I'm using it to fix the potholes in the road and a tire blows. Well my front tires look like they're shot so now I have to go out tomorrow morning and try to find, see if anybody's got tires in my city and can fix my tires tomorrow. It's been one thing after another. Last Friday a visitor from New York showed up who I was expecting, but I was expecting him on Saturday. He showed up on Friday a day early, so I had to spend time with him so I didn't get a chance to do my emails for Friday. And then when we know, got to the, when he got to the farm, we noticed that his car was overheating really bad. We checked it out and had a really badly cracked head. So that required a bunch of traveling around and a head to be shipped in from Winnipeg since we couldn't find a head to fit his diesel vehicle. And then a whole bunch more traveling around and then going back with him and reassembling the engine at the farm and finally today, after being here five days and staying with me, we got a chance to drive back home. So all of this takes away from my time to be able to edit videos, answer my messages, run YouTube and make more videos. I have so many ideas but I just can't find the time anymore. For the last couple of weeks, I've been unable to read the newspapers as I normally do, watch any television. I can just barely keep up maintaining things at the farm and not even have time to now to maintain the vehicles at the farm. I have a whole bunch of broken ones that we can't even drive and use for videos. Just minor problems, but they all need repairs and with all the rain we've been getting, there's not that many days I'm able to repair them. So just give me a chance, everybody. I'm capable of making the videos like you guys like, but with everything going on at the same time and a few things that are going wrong, it's becoming impossible. I'm only one guy. Rick helps me sometimes, but he doesn't have a driver's license or live nearby. So that means I've got to drive 20, 25 minutes each direction just to pick him up for help. And then when I come back, I have to drive him 25 minutes back each direction to drop him off again, so that takes a couple hours out of each day. Also, most evenings I have to go out and fix major appliances and central air conditioning and problems at people's homes, service calls, so that takes away my evenings. Now it's 9 o'clock at night and I'm trying to make this video and the damn neighbor over there is running a big lawn tractor cutting his lawn. This, this has happened so many times, I try to make a video in my backyard of something interesting, a repair video, just to find a time when someone's not cutting the grass, customers aren't walking in, and other things aren't going on, is really tough. What I need is less rain, some better weather, and more hours in the day, just to get the things done I want to do. Back in the good old days, I used to have enough time to build crazy things like redneck roller coasters, motorized bicycles, motorized skateboards. But nowadays, I spend all that 40 hours a week of extra time which I would have had just maintaining YouTube. So this is why you haven't seen any intensive construction videos lately. Sure, the uh, redneck roller coaster van would have been done, but the tractor broke. Today I could have finished it again, but the tire went flat. 
So it's all on hold. The pole's all ready to drop on and start welding. But we'll have to see if I can get tires tomorrow. So anyways, everybody be patient. Give me a chance to try to get caught up. If more things go wrong and more people show up and stay too long, it'll just take longer to get the job done. Thanks for listening.